everybody, I'm Shah from Charlie's Angel Tarot and I've got a couple of decks in like I've been promising you and I was I was advised to that these were really really nice because do you remember that we had that discussion uh, on every zodiac sign that I did and I went live and uh, I think it was Capricorn and Aquarius there was a lady that came in and said um, I don't like uh, tarot cards or mm, from Diana Vir no sorry Diana Virtue I hope she's watching so here's the proof thank you very much for your advice and I'm open to any other suggestions so let's have a look what the uh, s uh, postcards of from spirit look like and what they say they're by Colland Collett Baron Reed and I've also got my Shadowlands so if you would like to go and have a look at the um, Shadowlands a review then go ahead I'll be coming out with more decks and this is this is really amazing I've seen the back uh, of them and I've done some research on it and I wonder what they look like in real life so I hope you will share and give us the thumbs up and I'll just that's just the box and it's purple on the inside and that is spirituality so they're welcome I love that I haven't got a box like this it's nice you get a little booklet with it the third card on how as how to do spreads and how to work with the postcards and it's also printed on the back about the uh, author, uh, about the artist. Uh, it looks more like an old fashioned postcard. Uh, no, um, driving license. God, I must be getting old. <laughs> ah, they're really packed tight, and I'll be using them in the life as well. Um, they look like this just like a postcard on the front, and then the message on the back. So I hope you can see them. And it's got a stamp. I don't know whether every stamp is from heaven. Two cents. And again, they do differ from uh, the pictures. Do differ. And this is two cents from heaven. Oh, I love them. They're really nice. Hummingbird. They remind me of the inspiration cards. You are loved. That's what it says very lightly. You are loved. And that's what it says on every card. And the message is on the back. And this is an angel. And we've got two angel heads. And they're pretty sturdy cards. So they're really good for shoveling as well. They're ma I like them because they're matte finish. And I like the pictures. I hope you can see it. Very sort of like shadowy, but I love it. The moon. Stars. Love you to the moon and back again. Love it. And the stars. An elephant with its trunk up that means good luck and then we've got an angels with uh, leaves I really think they're adorable they're very sweet and I like the way they are also in different colors that's a swan makes you concentrate think that's Cupid an angel in an upside down heart and that's Pegasus the myth mythological horse mermaid I think I 
that is an angel's cupids and a rose. Cupid and a rose. I like the stamps as well, the idea of the stamp from heaven. Oh, the kissing angels. I don't know, I think this is a baby angel. Looks a bit like 18th century. Well, there's a lot of cupids. There really is the same size as a postcard would be. They're really good cards because you can use them as a message at the ending of the reading or to open up a reading with. Antelope. It's a really sturdy box. A dragon. I'm so infused with the, the, these cards as well. They're beautiful. The last card, I will read the message, even if only they're really beautiful. A dragonfly. I wonder how many there are. I'm trying to look at the back of the box. And they that you can feel that they are covered with plastic, but they're very thick cards. Swallow. Key. Butterfly, this, this is an angel waving goodbye, I don't know whether you can see it. It's also waving goodbye, looks like, like if she's standing on a pillar. And a heart, and then you have a pinkish angel playing the harp. You can hardly see the harp on the camera. Oh, the cup of love, chalices, and it looks a bit like. Um, the angels holding reins and two fishes swimming away. And then you've got a Capricorn um, unicorn. And I'll read the last message. Dear you, it's quite a long message. Look at that. There is only one you, and you have a unique place in this universe. Sometimes situations come up that challenge you to be authentic and that means you have to be fully yourself and let go of being what you think others may want now is not the time to conform to other people's standards or expectations be proud of who you are and be courageous stand tall in your convictions 
being yourself is a powerful statement and will only lead you to success and ultimately happiness. Don't compare yourself to other people. Want what you have because what you, your heart wants and know that your purpose is yours alone. No one else can claim your magic nor take it away. When you place authenticity and originality high on your list of priorities and give them a prominent place in your awareness, extraordinary things happen. Your life is beautiful one, is a beautiful one. Love you always and forever. There you go. And I think these cards are nice. Once you've done a reading and you've closed the reading with it, um, it's also very nice to pull a card for the day for yourself and it gives you something to think about. Now they're, they're very pointy so they are sharp, sharp so I know some people do deck corrections but I don't. I don't adjust my decks and they are very sturdy and I suppose you could also shake them this way, that would be better because they're quite broad and they're really nice to shake let's have a look I want to use them tonight yep, brilliant I've got to get used to it, you can shake them now, if people have rheumatism in their hands, it might be a little bit hard. You, you can't take this side, but you'll have to take the narrow side. Okay. Okay. Okay, awesome. And that is the box. And it's it won't fall off the lid, because it will stay stuck, but it's really tightly fit. I love them, I think they're great and uh, I think the messages are long so um, I think one day a card would be fine as the message for the day or finish off a reading for a querent they can take that with them and they can take a photo of it so they can take it with them and they're very clear because they're typed very clearly you can see Okay, I hope you've enjoyed that review. Those cards were made by Colin, Colette Baron Reed, postcards from Spirit, and I love them. So I hope to see you in your life. So please share and like, and um, let us know what you thought of this deck. And go and have a look at the review that I've just done on the Shadowland Tarot from Mo uh, Monica Brovinsky. Take care, stay safe, and I love you all. Ciao, ciao.